Hi guys, yeah, I'm <laughs> sorry it's been like months, but um, I'm in college now, and so I figured it might be a good idea to make a video when I'm in the middle of my first semester because one better a time to um, tell you guys what it's like, because, I mean, people don't really prepare you for college very well before you get there, so my roommates are out, and it's going to be really awkward if they walk in while I'm making this video because they don't know I vlog, but... Here I am, so I'm gonna talk about college, I guess, and maybe you'll pick up on some hints and stuff that I wish I knew before I entered. So I guess you've probably heard before that high school doesn't prepare you for college because, I mean, that seems to be the point, and then when they don't, you get here, and it's true. They don't prepare you enough, like... I mean, they prepare you some, and you really need to take your time in high school to get to know yourself, because you high school can't prepare yourself, but you can prepare yourself when you're in high school. So get to know your learning style. That's very important if you need to, like, write things down in a planner, or if you're one of those people that, like, you stay on top of things. You need to know that. It's very useful when you get to college, but, you know, they don't teach you that in high school. I mean, they used to always give us planners, but nowadays they're like, you got a laptop, you don't need a planner. Well, you still do sometimes. Um, I don't know. College, it's a blur. Like, the first week, it's intense, and it's really scary. I mean, you're all on your own, and I, when I was younger, never took the chance to, like, go on a summer camp or stay away from home for a prolonged period of time. Like, I didn't even stay at my grandparents' house, like, without my mom. So... <laughs> The transition to college was kind of hard for me, and it took quite a few weeks to actually get into it. So, I mean, take opportunities you get to get out on your own and become an adult gradually and start getting thrown into it, because it's really hard to just become an adult when people want you to. So, you know, work on that. Help yourself. Like, do yourself a favor and get out there. Be an adult. Um, I mean... It'll help the first week, but even so, it's kind of hard. You're just throwing a bunch of syllabuses, and you have to keep up on it on your own. Your teachers and your professors won't tell you things. I mean, you have to be responsible for yourself, and so teaching yourself that is a really important skill, especially, like, once you get here, life will be easier. All right, so shout out to all the people in college because I know you're working hard, and I am too. Uh, I actually gave myself tonight off. It's very important when you're in college to take care of yourself first. Like, if you need a day off, give yourself a day off. Like, I spent today going out with some old friends, and then I just hung around in my pajamas and watched Mean Girls because it's October 3rd. So, yeah. Um, but make sure you give time for yourself. Take care of yourself. I mean, it's important. You are important. You are more important than the degree you are going for. So when you're in college, make sure you put yourself first. Like, I didn't eat much today. I never went to the dining hall, which is, like, shame on me, because all I had was yogurt for breakfast and then a piece of cheesecake when I went out with my friends. So I'm probably, like, still running on a sugar rush, and that's it. So, yeah, I probably should take care of myself better, but, you know. Um, if you're in college, it can be really stressful, and you just, some people, you know, you have to take things one day at a time. Others of you, you know you can look ahead. And so it's important to know yourself, another reason why. Like, take care of yourself. Know yourself. And, I don't know, college is scary. But you gotta, it's just a part of life. And it'll help you become an adult. I mean, if you're not there already, it'll build you up for that. You know, it makes you stronger. And... It may seem like everything's against you, but it's making you, it's like character building, you know. Bad things happen to you and you're like, oh well, builds character. It's not just in the cartoons that it builds character, it actually does. So, you know, right now, it's a struggle and you might take things harshly, but when you look back, I'm sure it's going to be rewarding. So, you know, just love yourself for it. I know it's hard, there's going to be days when you just don't feel like it. I mean... College can give you depressive swings, but you gotta keep looking forward, you gotta take care of yourself, you gotta love yourself. College is rough, but you know what? It gets better. Life 
it's just a part of it, you know, and college is, might be the hardest part, so just think you're almost there to better things, I don't know. The world of college is a struggle, but I'm sure it's going to be worth it, and maybe I'm just telling myself that because I'm, like, barely into it, I mean, halfway through a semester, but still, you gotta have, you gotta have some kind of hope, so, to drive you through, and that's what I'm going on, I guess, but if you're in college, I know your pain, um, granted I'm an art student, so it's not like I study all the time, but I'm doing art all the time, so it's a little different, but, I mean, we're in this together, all us college students, and many have made it through before us, so we can do it too. I mean, empower yourself, because you deserve it, and I know I deserve it, and we all gotta work hard and keep going. If you're in high school, college is scary, and there's probably vlog videos of people crying their eyes out over college, but, you know, the, you gotta let yourself cry some days. And you gotta know that you're gonna get over it and you're gonna get through it. And, you know, someday you'll be in a better place. Because college is not the the end and, and all of everything, you know. You'll get through it. I'm pretty sure. Like, don't let it get you down because you can do it. I have faith in you. And, you know, if you're scared of college, that's okay. It's normal. But you gotta be brave. Like, Watch my video on bravery, because being brave can get you so far. It can get you further than you thought you could be, so. Well, I guess this will be the end of my video, because I keep, like, reiterating and ranting on college, and I don't know. It makes me realize how much it kind of sucks, but I'm not worried. I think I can do it, and I know you could do it, too, if you really try. You just gotta put in some effort and take care of yourself and be the adult that you need to be because being an adult is hard, but someday it should be worth it. I mean, we can't all stay children forever, so. Ah, watch other videos of mine if you feel like it. I know this video I've got wet hair because I just got out of the shower and everything's rushed and I'm like, ugh, but running on sugar, like I said. Um, but I swear in my other videos I'm a much more sane person and I wasn't in college then, so I didn't have the hard facts of being an adult in life, but, I mean, they might be interesting. Uh, I should stop ranting, but it's the sugar. I promise. Anyways, uh, I'm on Tumblr. If you want to follow me, I'm Topazzle, T-O-P-A-Z-Z-L-E. I am so glad that you watched this video. I hope that if you are in college, or seek college in your future, or even if you've been through it before, you know that... College is interesting, college is hard, but college is doable, so yeah, it's worth it, I think. I'm not 100% sure yet, I'll know by the end. Maybe I won't be making vlog videos then though, because I barely even made this one. So, eh, lucky me, my roommates didn't walk in, and um, thanks for watching. Uh, I hope if you're in college or looking towards college, this can help you, and uh, so yeah, see you around, I guess. I don't know when, but...